Did I miss the frag out? Gosh, I did. No. All right. <sighs> Actually, one second, one second. How you guys doing? How we doing? Let me get this thing booted up for the in. What's it called? My touch portal so I can swap between slides easier. Let me get that going. Once it boots up, we're good. We're Gucci. We're Gucci. Okay, it looks like we're we're good. And that's just boom and bada bing bada boom. What's going on, guys? We're rocking the uh, we're rocking the uh, thing again. The baby OT. So three minutes ago, we got a Fred Rowe. Um, or Fred Dro 31 for the sub. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Um, and before stream, Ali continued his membership for the channel. So appreciate you, Ali. Um, one sec. I got to pull this thing up so I can hear the notifications. Okay. Um, how you guys doing? How you guys doing? So yeah, I'm streaming a little bit earlier just because I don't know when those other boys are gonna stream, you know? I don't know. So we're gonna just go a little bit earlier, you know? We're gonna go a little bit earlier today. Plus I'm actually ready to stream today. The one thing, dude, my light, look, my lighting in my room looks me looks so, I'm not this light, guys. Maybe I am. I need, I need like a new lighting thing, dude. <laughs> It used to be okay, and then I moved stuff around, and this light's a better light on my left. You can hardly see it. The one on the right, you can see more, so it's just bad. But that is neither here nor there. See, I still haven't done this. I wanna, I'm want to. i not going to have this chat up for much, but I do want to make a background, or a, a, a black, I guess, thing to uh, help the text so it's easier to see, but make the opacity on it a little bit lower. But we'll do that. I'll, I have to remind myself of some of these things, so... So, so, so. I don't even know like what my guy looks like, like what his defenses are because we were just starting off. Typically, I'm sorry, Bezor, I don't have any spots. I don't know who you are, man. I'm sorry. Maybe another maybe time, maybe, maybe another time. Okay. I like the earlier streams, it's not that late here as usual. If you go outside, the sun will tan. Does it really? I never knew that, gosh. I might have to give that a shot. I haven't gone outside in a few months. Maybe that should help. Okay, let's see who's here. That title says Miss Owsley. You like that title, guys? I'm gonna change it, but I thought that was a kind of funny title. Got Roxor, we got Lloyd. See, Lloyd, Lloyd gets it. To catch them is my request. To train them is my cause. And then Swedish, oh, and Swedish gets it too. I'm gonna travel across the land. Searching far and wide. Teach Pokemon to understand the power that's inside. You guys get it. You guys get it, man. Digital monsters. Digimon. Digital monster. Champion. You guys get it. Red Sox trade Mookie. It's come on, man. The Red Sox? The boss Red Sox? I, dude, I don't follow baseball anymore. I used to back in like 2012 when I was actually into baseball. I remember when I was when I liked them a lot. They had Dustin Pedroia, they had Big Poppy still, they had Jacoby Ellsbury, they had Daisuke Machizaka. Um, their their catcher, I forget his name, but he was pretty badass. Um, I forget a lot of those, but that was like the last time I remember watching them. You got Ricardo too. Yeah, it, it, see. You know what, Ricardo, I kind of did this for you, man. Because you missed some of them, right? You can't watch them all live. So here you go, man. A little bit live. A little bit earlier for you, so you can watch it live all together. Afroda, says Romjo. Heck yeah, man. You like it? You guys like the thumbnails for this, this week? Afroda. <laughs> Got CB. Says, hey, Ian, how you doing, CB? Me, Zylo. Oof. What's up, Zylo? How you doing, man? 
Thank you, thank you. Let's see who else we got here. Up in here. Got Slarf, says may the RNG be with you. You know what, guys? I looked at this guy's GAC history, and it looks pretty tough. He places some tough teams on defense. But guess what? I got some good counters. I feel like you're the best strategist in this game, honestly. My <laughs> tough anyway. Nah, dude, I'm not that good. I still have my I still have my ideas and, and insights from Blade Baka. Um, we got Prometheus as well. Uh, Sung from your childhood, heck yeah. I am Swigos Reckoning, says Sean. Got Alonzo. Oh my gosh, dude. You got some shiny Xyla, gosh. I haven't played that either in a long time. When that was first out, I freaking love that. Blade's Nasty Arena Shard says hi. Oof. Oof. Alright, guys. Um... <laughs> uh, let's see, Matt says, well, I guess I don't take this game too seriously if I don't check ahead for my opponent places and just wing it. Well, today, guess what? We're kind of winging it to a degree, but let's let's check this out. Let's check this bad boy out. So we are in 19 just because people ahead of me are already doing their attacks. They've already attacked. Look, they've already done their attacks. See? Um, I was in 5th before before tax went live. But we are fighting a guy that has a lean roster like myself. But the, here's the catch. Um, the catch here is that I think he has less gear 13s than me. I'm pretty sure. You know, I'm not too sure actually. I think we're just very, very evenly matched. Um, if I were to just double check the mod game here, I think I have something pulled up to just check this all. I don't typically check the mods like this, but I should. I feel like doing it. I feel like doing it. Let me let me just check the the whole comparison. I'll pull it up on screen as well. So we're gonna pull this one up. Open up link. Okay. And then there we go. We should be already swapped over. There we go. It worked this time. I always gotta double check that thing. Okay, but here we go. Oh, why is it so bad? Oh, I pulled up the wrong link. One sec. Open original, yeah. You gotta, you gotta do that. Okay, now it's now we're good. Now you guys should be able to see this. You guys see this, right? Okay. The gun show tonight. Ooh, you know I didn't do biceps. That was yesterday's, but I did do chest and triceps today. Um, let's see here. The mole tag. What's up, Sean? What's up, Wham, bro? What's up? What's up? Philadelphia. Philadelphia. I see now that's one birth is irrelevant. It's what you do that determines who you are. Dude, that's that's a deep quote right there, man. That's a deep quote. Oh, I just hit something. Okay. So let's get that out of the way for myself, because that's kind of bothering me. Um, and boom, we get Tyler Wright with a sub. Thank you for joining, man. Hopefully you enjoy it here. Um, okay, how's the mal? Ray, I just got, or the guy just responded to me a few days ago, so I got to do something like that. But I want to see, my my man Dagger has some uh, some battles that he is long overdue for me to show me of his under star and under gear malevolence and droid and separatist beating out a uh, maxed out um, negotiator team. And I want to see some of those. So, and also Ace is high with a two dollar donation super chat says, "What's your GP at nowadays, Ian?" Um, so I guess you can see right here. Boom, boom, boom. I'm at 4.863. Um, the character, I have 2.8 and 2, 2 mil. We'll just say 2 mil ship GP right there. That's where I'm at right now. All right, so we're going to do a little bit of checking out my dude. I already checked him before, but just to let you guys know like who we're fighting. So um, the ones we already fought beforehand was this guy, Darth Molly. You know what's funny is that this guy, I thought, was probably the, the hardest opponent. And he didn't even play as... He didn't even play as GAC. He didn't even play. He didn't even attack me back, guys. He said he was busy, so that's just unfortunate. So. Um, okay, so the guy we're really fighting today is at the very end. It's kind of unfortunate how mine's the very beginning and his is the very end. But pretty much, if you guys don't know this bot, you guys, if you're in my Discord, you have use to it, but you only get 20 uses. But if you think about it, 20 uses, that's like 20 different weeks of GAC. You're going to have a lot of different uses. After those uses are up on this bot, then you have to you have to be a Patreon. It's not that much to use this whenever you want. 
Um, but this bot does um, a lot of different things for your TWs, your guilds. This is kind of a, a sponsor, or not really sponsor, but I'm kind of... I, I like this because my guild uses it, and I love using it in my GACs for figuring this stuff out. So, this is who we're fighting today. His name is Padellos. Um, I can't go any further to the right, so that's as best we can get. But, um, he's in a he's in a two point, or 244 mil GP guild. Um, this was like way before, so I'm not too worried about his season status right now. But what's interesting here, just like when you guys are seeing stuff like this, it's always nice to see. Now that we have GAC history, now this season stats, you want to check those two things. Because if you can see really how hard he goes on defense, um, well, first and foremost, you want to check this, I think, in, in, in your, your first analysis, right? If it says, like you can see here, he has 133 defense, that typically, to me, means that he, he goes a little bit hard on defense. And then once you see that, then I would go check out his GAC history, and then you can really figure out what he's got. Um, and what he typically plays is because if he's if he has those consistent defense that's when you're like okay this guy's probably gonna go a little bit hard on defense you know stuff like that um but here's the the juicy stuff here man um so he has a 4.7 he's got a little bit lower gp than me um and my top 80 is a little bit better than his which is always good to see but our ships and our character gp is pretty much the exact same same with our zetas um, but, like I said, or wait, 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 wait. Do the greens, oh my gosh, I forget. What does the greens mean? In, so I think the reds mean he beats me there. When it's just black, that means we're even, right? Let's just check. Yeah, okay. Okay, so I think I kind of mis misspoke some of this stuff. Okay, so if that's the case, then he has a better... Then he has a better top 80 than me. Okay, yeah, this makes sense. So he has a better top 80 than me, but we have similar from character GP on, on Zetas. He has more gear 11s, gear 13s than me, gear 12s than me, gear 11s than me. What? One sec. Let's see this. I guess he does. Wow. 26 of my gear 13s to what does he have again? No way. Hang on. 26. Wow. He has eight more gear 13s than me. Interesting, man. So what that means to me, without even looking down below, that means he just has like no really high relic sevens. He's really playing them low. So, now the juicy stuff here, guys, is the mods. The mods, the mods, the mods. This is the biggest thing when you're looking. And I, I can just guarantee you right now, I think I have way over 100 of these six dots. So, I, way, I, I beat him a hardcore there. I have a couple more 25s than him. I have more 20s. And I have more 15s. The 10s don't matter as much because... Um, tens don't matter. I'm saying this because in GAC, you're only needing eight teams for offense, eight teams for defense. That's more than enough sets for 16 teams. So I'm not too worried about that. Um, and then here we go. He actually has four relic sevens. I have five, I think. Um, so he beats me in all my relics. So this is kind of weird that he has more relics than me. But I think we're just matched up because of our GP similarity. But he still beats me by relics, um, and then here we go. He's got he's got Darth he's got GS he's got Darth Revan Darth Malak and BSF, boom 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 boom. He's got even Watt, boom boom boom. He's got he's got a tenacity on Ness. He's got Padme. However, this is modded for slow, so we're not too worried there. What's the data difference? Um, it's not too bad. It is. I'll pull it up. Eighty-five to I think eighty-six. One second, guys. I Holy poop, dude, that was disgusting. I'm so glad that I, I did that. Okay. Okay, let's see this. Yeah, mods are way more important than gear, so I'm totally, I think I'm totally safe here. 
Yeah, I'll, I saw the DM dagger. I just went live as soon as you saw that, so I'll check that out later. Is this the? Yeah, it's the. It's that one. It's the shitty Billbot. Um, Ray. Have I watched Spaceballs yet, Ouchie? Um, no. I mean, like the thing with some of these older movies, like I watched some older movies, like I've watched Fletch, I've watched Tommy Boy, like all these bigger '80s movies. Um, I just never got around to, like, Spaceballs. I think the only reason was is because my dad and my mom thought it was too crude. They were, they thought it was way too crude. But I'll, I'm old enough I can watch it. Holy cow, I'm way old enough. I mean, I, I love John Candy. I love Rick Moranis, so I'm sure I love the movie. I, I like to know, like, Man, we ain't found shit out here. Like, I know that. I know some quotes from the movie. I just haven't seen it all the way through. Um... What are you using to check your opponents? The, yeah, this is this is called, uh, or what we saw earlier was called um, Hot Sauce Bots. If you guys want to, I can leave you a link to it. Anybody, if anybody's interested, just let me know. I can leave a link to it, to the Discord server. Well, from the Discord server, it really helps you out with getting it on your server, how to use it, how, how, it all, how it all functions out. So just let me know. I can figure that out for you guys. The Great Outdoors, oh, that's a good one. The ninety or was it the ninety six or the stakey eight? Holy cow! Gosh. All right, guys. So now this is what I'm kind of curious about. I check this a little bit just for you guys, for your guys' sake. When it comes to my attacking, I'm okay with fighting a gas. I'm okay with fighting Darth Revan, but I really don't like separatists. That's why I've been putting a lot of um, energy and resources into my my JKR counter. So, he has Relics up Grievous, B1, B2, Magna. So those four big droids, he's got Relics up. And the, the kind of, the saving grace here is he's, he's only got a Relic, or a, not Relic, he's only got a six-star Watt. Um, but from his JC history, he always runs BB-8 GG. But I'm pretty sure I can beat that still with how my team is. So we should be okay. Um, and then counters to my gas, if he does decide to save him. He has that gas counter. I've seen him use it in his uh, previous stuff, so he's got that counter. Um, he's even got counters to my Grievous team as well. However, I'm using a BB-8 as well on G on defense with my Grievous, so it's going to be a bit tougher, I think, for him because um, he doesn't have crazy high relics. So it's going to be kind of, I would say, it's going to be similar to what I'm going to be fighting him. You know, this entire match is really, really even. I can't say this is a bad match make. This is really even. I can't, I can't really say anything negative about this. But you know. We'll, we'll try to see you guys. Okay. So let's use defenses. So I'm expecting some big stuff here. So yeah, there it is. Um, Grievous and Darth Revan in the front wall. And, he's, and then he's got the bugs. He's already uh, he's already attacked me. So he already cleared that. I'm assuming he used his JKR versus that. Okay. So yeah, this guy does watch some of the stuff, but I had to play it safe because I knew he watches it. So I had to play it safe and throw in some crazier stuff. Okay. So we have a few ideas we could do here. There are no feats. I'm pretty sure there's no feats for us to do right now. Yeah, so we're just playing for the win, which I like. You didn't miss anything, Steve, but we're just getting started now. He must be attacking like right now, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He pretty much, this just started, so. He's probably going back and forth. Um, okay, so this is his team. I'm just curious to see what it is. So it does have Malak. That's good for us. And I, like I expected, he's gonna pop, he's gonna he's gonna toss in BB-8 here. So I did remod after this JC lock. So I gotta make sure my Jedi can take this on. So we're gonna we would be using Bastila lead. We'd be using Hermit, Jolie, him and him. So just Jolie's mods really fast. You should have some decent HP, right? 80k. Yeah, I'm very confident I think this will work. I had to remod my Yoda, man. Yeah, it's Hotbot, Grande. It's only 55 banners from or versus my GG. That's pretty good. I'll take that. So, I think it's only right that uh, that we, since he fought my Grievous first, I fight his Grievous first, you know? Just to even things out a little bit. Don't you guys think? So I'm gonna do this. Let's do it. Let's do it, boys. Let's make sure I don't have anything turned on for the, what's it called? 
Okay, I don't I don't have any of my things turned on, so we're good. Okay, so we're gonna give this master training to my my GMY. We're gonna do this, and then we're going to spread the buffs. So this is kind of unfortunate because I would have rathered my or I would rather have his B2 use this thing so he comes out of stealth, but he's not out of stealth yet, which really sucks. I don't like that. So we're going to have to just try to hope that he does it now. Still. Okay. Now he does it. Okay, now we can now we can hit him. Okay, so if we can kill him and then work down Magnet, that's really, really good. So like if I can just do a little hit here. He's gonna get his bonus turn. My Jolie, look at his protection, guys. We're, we're totally fine. And my and my uh my Yoda still has his protection up, so we should be okay here still. I'm gonna do that so we get more foresight. He dies there, so we're gonna need to get a revive ASAP so we get that stuff back. I'm not doing an AoE there because that would kill B B8. So we're gonna hope for a stun, no stun. Okay, stun's coming up, or the cleanse here with the revive, boom. And same thing here, we're not doing an AoE, it would kill BB8. We're waiting for our our JKR to get his turn, but I'm pretty sure he's gonna get targeted. He doesn't get targeted, okay, that's good RNG. That's really good RNG. Okay, so I can do one of these because he has foresight. And then just do another one of these hits. And then I think I should have Mark up here soon. So that might kill, yeah, that's gonna kill, dang. Oh, he, he, oh, he survived that, that's pretty big, guys. Um, I'm going to give this to um, Jolie just so he's tank even more so. He's even tankier. I'm actually give this to him so it heals him up a little bit more. And then we can do a nice little mark. And now we're good. Now we're good. So this is a little bit... Yeah, BB-8 a little bit scarier. I think I would only be more scared if uh, if he had like insane relics on his B-1. or his uh, Yeah, his B-1. Like insane relics on his B-1. So we just lost somebody there. Um, I think we'll be okay though still. Cause yeah, we, we got to revive again. Holy cow! If his B if his B one had insane, like I'm talking crazy offense, then I'd be kind of a, a kind of afraid a little bit. But he doesn't. So we got the sun and TMR. That's hot. That's what we would like to see. Got to pick up the church. All right, see you, dagger. Thanks for coming by, man. I'll, I'll check out the message uh, after stream. We got their markup, boom. Let's see, let's see how this goes down, and so close. Boom, there we go. Um, and let's see what else we can get here. Let's just give it to him, I guess, to JKR. It wouldn't do anything for us anyways. So 57. We got it, we got it. We got it, guys. We got it. Okay, so next up, I I don't like this team, so I'm gonna just use my my gas. I really don't like messing with this team at all. This is just like one of those teams I don't like messing with because my Padme, like, especially when my Padme is not modded for this team to take out Darth Revens. Gotta lock it in. There we go. Yeah, no, no Jordica. We're, we're fine. Okay, so we're gonna give the TM up. Hit up him a little bit. Sith Trooper. Try to... See, this is... He has a pre taunt here, so it would have been nicer if I had a Dispeller. Or if I had my arc rather faster than uh, than the others. So, like, right here, I want to do some more hits. But if he goes below half health, then he's going to get his taunt back. So, I think I just kill him right now. And then say, yep, save this for Malak. Okay. That was really good. Um, and now we're going to go kill Marauder. We tank that like I thought. Um, hopefully this can do some big damage to Darth Revan. Nope, it almost did, though. Okay, so... Dang, I really wanted to kill Darth Revan so I can get a little bit better banners, but I think we'll be okay still. We're gonna lose. We're gonna proc our... Uh, yep, we're gonna proc our little thing there. Okay, so at least we're gonna still gonna kill Darth Revan. We're just gonna lose some banners there. All right, what do we get? I'm, I'm 50, yeah, 52. So it's not great. It's not great. That's just how these ones go versus versus Arc Revens. So what's this back wall looking like? Gas. So for gas, we have to use our CLS. 
how is my gas modded for crit damage and also defense so this is the next big the, the three biggest counters we just are all hitting back to back to back to back So for this one, I'm using Old Ben with 3PO. I'm not going to use Watt here. I'm going to... Actually, let's see. He does have this team, but I don't think it's going to be that crazy because he put his best clones there. So, actually, what is this gas modded? Okay, he has defense with offense, so... We should be okay, I think. If he, had, if he had an entirely full defense set, then I would have to use Watt. I would be forced to use Watt in there, but I think we'll get this going. Without our Watt, we should be okay. Okay, lock it in, boys. Lock it in. Okay, boom, boom, boom. We gotta go. We gotta hope that our old Ben stays alive for a while. Mind trick him. We got the right debuff to stick. We're gonna do a basic there. We're gonna do another basic. We're gonna do put him into the freaking ground, man. We're gonna do one of these so that we get our TM somewhat high and now we use all of our big attacks here on fives always want to do basics so you get more exposes still doing the basics even with old ben that's unfortunate that's really unfortunate how we got us turn there i don't like that i don't like that at all actually because that means my 3po can't get his, his huge mass assist that's not good at all guys i don't like that dang it so i have to do this taunt now Dang it, dude. That's so unfortunate with the RNG, guys. The RNG just screwed us over. Big time, actually. I don't know if we can uh, beat this now. Oh, stay alive, Han. Stay alive, Han. The only way we win this now is if GS only hits our CLS. If he goes for if he goes for Chewie, we're dead. Nope, we lost. Damn it! Dude, when how fast is his echo, man? How fast is his echo? Dude, that's a gosh, dang it, man. I have never lost one of those before, guys. Never. That's going to probably cost it right there. That just cost it for us, guys. See how it works now when we don't lose 3PO? See how it looks now, guys? I'm going to rewatch this one. Or I'm going to rewatch my loss. I don't know how I lost. I don't know how I lost. Um, I'm assuming that the TM, the TMR on my old band didn't even land, and the ability block didn't even land. Both didn't land. 
Um, I don't even know what my what my my teams could even take to beat that that solo gas. It's gonna take something bigger. So I'm gonna just hold off there and go for the other wall. Okay, let's do these guys versus versus the bugs. All right, so we won this one. Um, two minutes ago, Marley the Cholo, thank you for the sub, man. I'm sorry I missed that. Thank you for the sub. Welcome, welcome. Try IPD versus Gas. I don't know, man. Okay. The good thing here, though, I'm pretty sure that is uh, the good thing here with, with this counter is we're gonna get a little bit banners for because our Treya is still full HP, so that's good. That's good. We're just waiting. We'll just kill now, I guess. And then we'll do this. Everybody, our tray is full, rather, and that should kill him. There we go. No, that's that's truly unlucky because my old vent has some decent potency, man. That's just rough. So now I'm kind of thinking of um, of splitting up my BSF. I'm thinking I just toss in like BSF with Thrawn and maybe another person versus the gas. I don't know. Because this isn't a crazy boss team. I think I can probably beat this without BSF with my EP. Check his tenacity on his echo. You can check that. He doesn't have a tenacity arrow though, or cross. It's, it's just not good potency. We just got really, really, really unlucky. You guys don't know how unlucky that is. The thing with IPD is that he has to go below 100% HP to die. Or to blow up. And that's never going to happen. He's going to one-shot IPD before that even happens. So that's probably a no-go. Um... So looking at this, what are, how far are we behind? Banner wise, I don't even know. I think he's really going for the entire full defense. I don't know, Civil War, what I can use. I'm really, I want to focus this one first. I want to see what I can use here. I'm, I'm really just thinking of just using like a, a cheesy team here. Okay. I'm going to just use these three and then just use some more Empire. I just I just want to save Thrawn, I think. That's the, that's the really the big thing. I want to try to save Thrawn if I need to use him versus the, the gas. The thing here, though, is that this isn't going to give me good banners because they're going to get hit from AoEs. That's where Thrawn comes in handy to recover some of those banners. But if I use uh, my crew team here, that would be really good. I might just use no because no, I can't actually. I could I could still use crew if I wanted to in some of the Kylos to kill the gas if I need to. Um, I don't know if I really want um, Death Trooper here. I think I could just four v five this. So let's do it. So we're getting some of that going. Some stuns. Boom, 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 boom. All right. See, there's the AOE. I brought in TFP just so he tries not to get ever t 
touched at all. Okay, I want to get a ability blocker on Zam so I don't get any stupid... What's it called? Um, no thermals. Okay, so we're going to get some more. Spread it all. Spread all love around. You know how it is. More stuns. More stuns. Okay. This is going to be a fat cooling blade. Holy. Let's go for Zam. 87k. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. Gotta go for him. We get full TM there. Dead again. I'm gonna bring it over here to the Bosk. To the Bosk. Some more fear. Stuns. Probably didn't need the stun actually there. I'm gonna be honest. That kind of sucks. I don't like Dengar in these. He just he just eats your banners, man. That's all he's here for. He makes so you don't get your protection back. That's all he's here for. That's annoying. Yeah, I know, right? He's a damn banner thief. True. Okay, what's in the back wall? Night Sisters. Okay. Let's breathe a little bit here. So. We still have two to three really good teams. We got Shock T still. Um, we don't have any clones though. So maybe, maybe no Shock T. Dang, guys. I might need to... Huh. I still have three more teams. Or four, really, because I still gotta beat... Ness is on defense. Um... Like, I think First Order and Wa is going to be the Night Sister counter. I got Padme, too. I don't think I need a full Padme team, though. I think versus, like, this team here, I wouldn't need a full Padme team. Like, I can just use Padme, um, GK, and Anakin versus this team here. Because they have a lot of um, cleansing, and they can't get debuffed. And then versus this team, I can use uh, Shock T. I could use like a Shock T team here and just like some other random people here with like Nihilus. So I'm, I'm looking at this. Yeah, they have they have um, R2 for a stun, but we if I can if I can use another stun person here, or I mean not stun another another person who can um, cleanse, that'd be awesome. So I think we just, straight off the bat, we go for this counter. But like, I don't, I think, I think Wa is going to be overkill here. I think Wa's way overkill if I use Wa right now. But like, how this counter works is with Wa, so I don't know how it would work without Wa. Um, I think my Padme could probably undersize that. If I can undersize that with Padme, I could use First Order and Watt somewhere else. Man, this is a this is a this is a this is a little bit tougher, guys, because now I gotta make sure I still got good banners, but I need to make sure I can kill his gas still. I really like the idea of using the First Order team versus the Lone Gas. Because that's like a guaranteed win, pretty much. Let's get more music going.
Yeah, I know. I know that FL can kill this. This like this is stupid easy with my FL Watt. Like you guys don't understand how easy that will be. Um, so what I'm thinking of is just using an undersized Padme team versus this Night Sister team. Just like four v five it. And then you shock T with some um, Galactic Republic versus another team. What's up, Mamba? Um, you missed me getting screwed over by RNG in the gas counter. Alright, so I'm going to do this, guys. I'm going to use just Padme. Undersize this one versus Night Sisters, so that allows me to use my crew versus something else. Um, I'm not using my big cleanse now because Asajj will just strip that away. Like that. Now we're going to do AoEs. Now we can't get plagued, so that worked out really good. Gonna strip that away. Gonna kill Asajj. Thank you, Jedi. Oh my gosh, Ki Kiandra for the sub. Thank you, thank you. Welcome. I'm not sure what's going on here, but I think I just killed them all. Or I killed the the zombie thing, so they only get two revives. I'm pretty sure we can just pretty much insta-kill them now. Kill him, or kill her, rather. There we go. There we go. And that gave me pretty much full banners. Yep. That would have been more than the others if I used First Order and Watt. So now... This team here with Shock T... You guys let me know. Um, walk this way. I like the name. Thank you for the sub, man. Appreciate it. Um, use Shakti, um, Echo, Fives, Rex, and Zerus against the team. If I had that, man, maybe. No, I think I'm going to use versus the Lone Gas uh, entire first order team. Oh, that's 5 0 first. First order. Like using an entire team like this. Or I could toss in Watt just to play it safe. What do you guys think? Do you guys think use Watt to play it safe versus this team? And toss out Phasma? Or save Watt for another team? Oh, we could use Gas here too. Or not gas, we can use Thrawn here too. How about we do that then? I like Thrawn, I think Thrawn's safe too. So what if we don't use Phasma and we use Thrawn instead? But I don't think I need Kylo here, the OG Kylo, because his stunts, my my crew stuns will be that just one, getting one turn stun off, or the two turns off with crew, should be enough for my Fracture to cycle him back to his other stun again. So I don't think my Kyle is going to be that important here. I think Phasma with her more TN capabilities will be even more important. You guys agree? Um, Hunter, thank you for the sub, man. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Welcome. I think this will beat it. Yeah, let's do this, guys. I got to make sure I'm on the right team. Okay, yeah, this is the right team. Okay, this is it. This should beat it. If it doesn't beat it with the amount of TM and stuff I have. Oh, boom, easy. Give this to him. Do turn. Easy peasy. Let's go. Okay, there we go. We're gonna just do this and then do some TMR. Fracture now. Easy peasy, guys. You look paler because uh, I worked out and I look like I just woke up. And also, my lights in my room suck ass. So it all plays into effect here. Let's see if we can kill GS. What? Hang on. I don't know. I don't know about this one, guys. Yikes.
Oh. Rockzor with the five. He says uh, GS needs a bow down the first order. See you, Ian. See you, Rockzor. Thanks for the five, man. Dude, first order coming clutch, guys. That was scary. I. The reason. Okay. That makes so much sense, guys. Why the stun came off is because I think whenever I, I either hit him or crit him, it removes the stuns or whatever the debuffs are. But the reason why Fracture sticks is because it's a locked debuff. See ya, Pete. Or, uh, Rockstar says, see ya, Pete. See ya, man. See ya. Thanks for the donation, man. I appreciate it. Um, and also, um, I think I missed a sub as well. Luke Solch. Yeah, dude, I... Thank you, Luke. I don't, I don't, I don't want to butcher your last name. Thank you, man. Um, that was pretty good, though. I'll take that. And now we can use... Um, guys, I don't, I don't know what I have left. I like the idea of Wampa here. We're going to have to use Wampa here, guys. Let's think of his toughest teams, man. I don't think he's going to be able to full clear me, guys. I don't think he will. Hey, Ian. Why do you think we had that feat where we needed to use those two old Sith Empire ships? Think something is coming? Yeah, maybe. I don't think so. Anytime soon. I don't think so. Anytime soon. Um. Okay, guys. So, there's two teams we have left, okay? We don't have any teams left. We have one team that we can use with Nihilus. There's a team with Shock T. We need another cleanse here. We need another cleanse. Any cleansers in chat? Watt. We could just use Watt here, I think. Because the, tough, the tougher team is for sure the other team. This is the tougher team, guys. This is the tougher team. So I think I use Watt versus this team. You guys think so? Any agreeers in chat? Okay, so the, the first team, let's just pick up the first team. What is the first team going to be? The first team I think is going to be with, with these guys because I want to get as many assists as possible. And where's the other guy I wanted to bring in? Oh, was it Qui-Gon? It might have been Qui-Gon. Where is Qui-Gon? Oh, there he is. So I think this is a team. I think this is one of the teams. But I don't know if this will work because there's not enough DPS. Ezra can't really do that much DPS. I need a tank here, guys. I need a tank. Is he considered a tank? No. That would have been perfect. <laughs> tank. Loki just might give it to him. Loki, guys, might just give it to... I might just toss him in so that he's a tank... The reason that I would rather have Stormtrooper is is because he's he's a lot more tanky. My Kanan sucks. The only the only three options I would even consider going for is Stormtrooper Han. But the, the thing with with how this taunt works is that it has to be this taunt. The taunt from Watts Tech doesn't count towards the extra team you're going to be getting whenever he gets hit. Um, two minutes ago I still miss this. Holy cow. Um, Pat Pat's oh my gosh Pachito. Uh, I don't know how to say your name, man. Thank you for the sub. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. 
Um, yeah, I know Mace is a tank and he's Galactic Republic, but he is not healthy at all. I am almost certain that if you come back here and we see what they have, that Kira, or not Kira, actually, yeah, Kira lead whenever they get crits, they get more offense, so his mission can just bust me open. Straight up. So, you you could recover protection more easily on Mace. But FO Stormtrooper is also a good option. The reason why I just like the idea of... Why I like this so much is because with Stormtrooper you're getting that tank tech, he has an ability where he can cleanse himself. And with all those dots going, he has an extra cleanse from the Watt tech as well. And then we can give the, the weapon tech to Ezra and then try to heal up our um, either Shock T or R2. I gotta use this. I think this is my best bet here, guys. And then for the other team, I would have to just use a really weird team. I could even try using my, my Imperial Troopers versus the other team. Can I can I imp can I imp troopers the other team? I think I think here or I think uh shock T is way too fast. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna be going way too fast. He's hitting me. So he beat my uh my Django nest. He beats it. Yeah, my my troopers can't handle any of these. What can Nihilus accomplish here? If only I had two Watts, I could use Watt in two different teams. Did I get hit by that snowstorm? No. Where I live, there's like no snow at all. Well, what, what team could we use here with Wampa versus this really weird team? Scoundrel allies have more crit chance. In addition, whenever they score a critical hit, they retain... Okay, so this is only for Scoundrels. So none of my, my Wampa will get any of this. Where do I live? I live in Southern Utah. I'm kind of thinking of using my Karth team and then using Wampa here as well. Cause I still have, I still have, um, I can use like Wampa here and then toss in Nihilus. That's not going to be a clean battle though. Guys, I don't think any of those teams that you're mentioning versus this team will work because you guys don't understand. This this Shock T will go first. She's going to use her Assault team on me, and she's going to instantly kill somebody. That's just how this is going to go down, man. I'm telling you guys. Because with that Assault team as well, she's going to give a Clone Trooper 100% TM. So if she gives that to either Cody or Sarge, they're going to kill somebody. Uh, no pretons. Nope, no pretons. That's why. I'm, that's why I'm afraid here, man. The only teams I can actually think of working is that Karth team with Wampa, and then tossing in. Like this team, and then tossing in like maybe this guy, Death Trooper. That's what I can think of. Guys, I need Watt more so for the other team than this team. That's out of the picture, so you can't use any Watts versus this team. Yeah, I have the Zwampa Zeta, so all these dots will really help out a lot.
This is such a tough one, man. This, this guys, this goes to show you what a battle looks like when you lose like one person like that, like like a three PO. I lost my three PO. Guess what happens? This happens. You're thinking Kira, Watt, Wampa, Kanders, Cad, Stormtrooper, Han. I don't know, man. The thing here is that they're going to have a little bit more HP recovery, so I can probably tank a little bit more. But I really need a cleanser here, man. Am I really going to be pulling out Akbar here? I don't see any use out of, um, I don't see any use from Death Trooper here. If, even if I do get a kill, man, I don't think that's going to be huge at all. Oh my gosh, this sucks. I kind of want to just toss in Stormtrooper Han. Because if he at least gets targeted after I get the taunts up, I get more TM. They don't have any debuffs outside of R2. Well, that's a good call too, Mira. I like that call actually. I wasn't. I, I forgot about R2. Um, if that's the case, then do I even want Stormtrooper Han? Do I even want Karth? If that's the case, then I don't even know if I want Karth. Lead. Hekbar lead, damn it. All allies recover or gain 40% while they're above. So that could be nice. I mean, just for the extra defense at the beginning. Karth lead is, yeah, Karth lead, I agree there, is pointless because there's only going to be two Old Republic. And I really only would want to go for Candorous just so I can get more dots for my Wampa and do more damage. That's it. He gives a lot of dots, true, but he is way too squishy. I'm thinking I'm going to have to two-shot two, two shot this one, guys. Vader, we already used him, unfortunately. Honestly, I'm just thinking it's going to go down the crapper. So I'm really just thinking of using IPD here, just so I can try to get a, a, a destroying thing off, a destruction, self-destruction off. Because then we still have a mass AoE dispel from the R2 stealth. Hell, I could even toss in Dengar here, guys. I could toss in Dengar and to stop that. I could just toss in Dengar here, man. This is so... This is like theory crafting to like the... I hate theory crafting like this in JCs. This this is so... This gives me anxiety, man. I hate this stuff. And then it all kind of comes back to... If I, if I wanted to... I still have Kira lead. <laughs> I still have Kira lead if I wanted to use her. And then just pull up a bunch of scoundrels out if I wanted to. Because if my if my Dengar gets crit and you get stealth, then R2 can't stealth anybody. The only thing I would be afraid of is uh
What happened to Watt? We're saving Watt, man. We have to save Watt for the other team, the other better team. I am so at a complete blank right now. Yeah, I, I think I gotta just accept the fact I'm gonna have to two shot this thing. I hate this so much. Why couldn't I just kill that gas in one shot, man? This stupid game. The DPS and shock is more, so save Watt. You think so? Man, those dots from the other team look really spicy. There is a dot train gonna happen here, man. A dot train. I'm telling you, man. Yeah, I'm gonna just probably use the tougher team here. Use it with Watt. I'm going in, guys. I'm going in. I don't know what else to do. Can I get a stun on mission? Of course not. Guys, please pray for me that this will work. I need this to work, everybody. Crit, damn it. <laughs> Stun, damn it. Oh my gosh. There you go. There you go. Stun, dude, come on. I want to get more protection up. We've got to stop this guy, though. Vandor can stun, or he can, he can really screw us up. We gotta get rid of that taunt. Yikes. Stun, please stun R2. Thank you. Oh my gosh. That is ridiculous. I'm gonna just kill L3. That's... I have to do that, guys.
I'm not getting why I'm not getting any crits on my Ezra. There are literally no crits. Literally no crits. Literally no crits! Can you guys say timeout? This is so gay. Actually stupid. Can I just get those crits all the time, please? It's not that hard to ask for. I'm telling you, it's really not. Thank you! You're calling me the wrong guy, man. Hey, yeah, you're so stupid. This team is AIDS, guys. Let me get one hit on him, please. Oh my gosh. Gosh damn it, dude. Guys, that's a GG. I think we lost this GAC. Padellos, man, good luck. I think you won me, man. I don't have anything else to use. All right. Man, you hate losing just to one shitty RNG run in one little shitty battle. Don't you guys hate that? Okay, so like right there, there's no there's no stealth. But we don't have a cleanser, so I think we're dead. Come on, crit, baby. <laughs> I love this game. I love this game so much, guys. You guys know how much stuff I save for offense, and I still can't kill this guy. You guys understand how unfortunate this entire GAC is. You guys don't understand. I don't think you guys understand. I save CLS, Gas, Padme. All these teams, JKR. All these teams. First order walk. All these teams. Every single counter has to work for me to be able to full clear him with max banners. If one of those don't work, and I get bad RNG, I lose. That's how it is, boys. What does Slarf say? Oh, come on. Get out of here, dude. Really? That's got to be a joke, right, Slarf? If you want to, you can DM me and we can chat that out, man, if you want to. I'm totally open. Totally open for that chat if you want to have that chat. 
All right, so let's see here. Just trying to get a full clear here, Ian. What you got, buddy? Thinking of just having to use uh, the bad boys here, huh? Thinking of using this. I don't even know if I like Karth here, man. I might just go with him. All right. Look at all these bonus turns they're getting, guys. Look at all these bonus turns they're getting, guys. I love this game so much. This game is so fun. Gosh. Doesn't get better than this. We're living the dreams. Alright, stunner. So the one person I needed alive died. That's a rip. That's a fat rip, guys. Alright, GG's. GG's. I needed to kill uh, R2 there if I wanted to have a chance at using troopers. But that's now down the drain. Um, should we try Danger Zone? I think it's worth a shot. The RNG is so beautiful here today, guys. You love it. At least we kill one of them. I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh my gosh. This is so painful. It's so painful. I can't kill shock. There's not enough DPS. Guys, understand that. I'm sorry. There's not enough DPS there. In that team, there is just not enough DPS. Plain and simple. There just is not. So. The next team I'm going to give a try is the Akbar team. With Leia. I'm going to toss in Savage here. If I can get somebody low, he can kill some muddy. But I need a stunner. Any stunners in chat? Any stunners in chat? I kind of like Tebow if I can get some TMR capabilities there. 
Maybe toss in Jin. Who knows? Who knows? They're going to start off with all their cleanses anyways. Isn't that insane how many how much extra turns they're getting off the start? That's insane to me. Of course, you gotta stun the one person I cannot have get stunned. It is so funny. It works like that, man. It's really comical at this point, guys. This is a this is a hilarious GAC. It really is. From how everything went at the very start, when we lost that one 3PO match and how it's now, it is comical at this point. I can only laugh. I really can. I can't do much of anything else. Okay. I'm seeing using this and using that, guys, but honestly, the amount of uh, turn and turn meter that this enemy shock T is going to be getting, there ain't no chance in hell I'm going to be able to beat that. I'm kind of mad right now. I'm going to go buy me a vault, I think, after this to make me feel better. What do you guys think? Buy a vault. Make yourself happier. Because that's what true happiness is, right? I even lost this one, too. But this is a better modded gas, so I understand. I understand. Or actually, is it? Let me check the speeds. I wonder... I wonder, I wonder. See, this is similar to who we just fought. But he has a little bit less protection. But he has more relics. Maybe that played a part into it. Let's just fight one more time. Throw my Jawas in the meat grinder. That's not a bad idea, honestly. But if my scavenger dies too fast, I'm screwed. I just didn't want to do it very, very first because I wanted to use it as the last resort. But guess what? We're already there. <laughs> so we'll probably try it out. Now, the, the only reason I'm kind of bummed out, like hardcore bummed out, is because I was on track to getting top, like, number one in GAC. But now it's it's thrown away. So You can't do anything about it, guys. You really can't. All I'm now shooting for in this game is to get Ray unlocked. The new Galactic Legend Ray. After I get her unlocked, I have so many different plans I'm going to be doing in my GACs. If I ever lose after that, I'm going to be kind of impressed, honestly. Very impressed, actually. So. Just another reason why I don't like Ness on defense. Just another reason why, man. Ness could have been used there. Could have beat that Shock T team. Easy peasy. I'm not sure how we lost this first one versus this person. So. Like, I'm, I'm gonna rewatch why I lost this GAC to that one gas battle in fives, or uh, rather, Echo getting his turn before me. But I'm gonna just guarantee right now it's two things that happened. He didn't get his TMR to stick, and the, the ability block. Those two things. Didn't happen, so I lost. And I don't think my defense can hold. I doubt it. Okay, so... Like, versus this, I don't know if my troopers can handle it. I would really rather try to use Nihilus versus this team. But, like, the synergy. This is a this is a synergistic team here. You have clones, you have Shock T lead. They're going to be... Shock T's going to be getting turn meter a lot. 
they're gonna pretty much take like two turns before you even get your turn. You know? So. So. I think it's Jawa time, boys. Where is my man? There he is. Scavengers in the bottom corner. They're not hitting him yet. That's good. That's really good. Keep on hitting everybody besides him. Please. Thank you. Keep on hitting everybody besides him. No. Didn't work. Damn it. GG's. Alright, let's just at least try to get uh, the other team in the back wall killed. And then that's it. That's all we can do here, boys. That's all we can that's all we got going for us, man. So with this, I'm gonna just toss in some of these boys. Um Some Sith. Because I can get some more evasion here with Nihilus. I don't have any more Sith. Wow. Okay. Um, who else can we bring in? Young Han. I think he can recover protection. Um, stuns. Stuns, stuns, stuns. So that's a TM guy, and he can dispel on a basic. I'm going to toss him in for a dispel. Um... I'll toss him in. He can't recover though, can he? Yeah, only if they were a droid. If that ally was a droid, also recover that, that. Yeah, they get all that stuff. But it can dispel um, debuffs. I'm kind of feeling like going with TFP or uh, Etho TP. So, dude, if you really have any issues with me saying that word gay, you can DM me and we can chat it out. It's not a good place to do it over my stream. So I appreciate the dono, but it's not, that's not, it's not a place. It's not a place, man. All right, let's get some more music going. All right, we got to kill Vandor first. Oh, you know what I should have done, though? I think what I should have done there... Okay, we'll, we'll do some of this, because I get more TM up. Um, Yeah, I'll, I'll refund you, man. I don't, I don't need that money from you, sorry. Okay, so... I need to land this. I think with a advantage, he inflicts buff me on Zabar, which is great. And then I can dispel this. Okay. So now, I'm going to just keep on doing this dice roll. Like, honest, guys, I am an open book. If you guys have an issue with how my streaming is... Feel free to hit me up, you know? Literally, the worst way you guys can do that is to do it on a live stream. That is the worst thing you can possibly do. So that's getting refunded, man. Hit me up on DMs, Discord. There you go. Sorry this, this stream is very negative. But guys, this is the reality of me wanting to be the best I can in this game for GAC. Something bad happens like this, I'm in rage. You know, that's just how... That's the reality of it, man. So... Let's do this. I don't know where this thing is so I can pull up. We'll do it. I'll, I'll figure it after. Yeah, it is 2020. I can't use some of these words. So, if I offended... Okay, this is my apology. If I offended anybody in the chat with me saying that word, I am truthfully sorry. Okay? Really, I am. I'm sorry. If you guys have any further issues with that, DM me on Discord, okay? I'm sorry. There are so many more people who stream video games and do content on games that do far worse than I do. One word like that, okay, it's an oopsie. 
I say sorry. What else can I do? So. King Ryan, I am right there with you, man. Okay, I'm going to try Imps. I know it probably won't work, but it's worth giving it a shot. I'm going to probably toss an IPD here, actually, just so I can try to get a thing. Isn't Lax somebody who I fought recently? Not recently, probably like a while ago. That's kind of silly. This is just a ridiculous team, guys. The synergy here is just off the charts it's insane. That got a kill there. Nope, close. I needed that AoE. Dang it, so close. So close. There's just so much RNG in these ones now that it's just ridiculous. Yeah, there's so much crap in that battle. I don't have anything else, guys. Hang on. One second. Alright, there you go. There's your refund, man. Boom. Alright, so I think we're done here. Um, I, I can't think of anything else. Maybe I, I should have brought in C3 there to heal up IPD a little bit more, but I doubt it would have worked because he was stunned. And he kept on getting targeted, so... We're going to chalk it up to our defenses here, guys, and hope and pray that it will hold. We got Darth Revan here still. I don't think it's that bad of checking out what he might have to, to use on offense. So he put his three best teams on defense. His Gas, his Grievous, and his Darth Revan all on defense. So please... Amuse me. What do you have left, my man? You have CLS. You have Darth Treya. That's two. Ness could probably solo a team. That's three. Padme, that's four. Wampa could also solo a team. That's five. JTR, six. And after that, that's about it. Maybe your, maybe your EP. Maybe your EP. Um, let me hide screen for a second. I want to check something out. Let me check something out, boys. So, yeah, he's going to be able to do that. Okay. I mean, if I, were, I would, if I were him playing, this is like an easy full clear. Really, it is. Okay, I'm gonna actually now rewatch the battle of why I lost this GAC. How far ago was it? Was it right here? We're gonna just watch this. I'll do an arena battle and I'll probably hop off. Yeah, here, here it is. Alright, let's watch this. What happened here, man? <sighs> okay, so we shoot first like we always do. You want to use a basic here, so you get more debuffs going early on. That way you can get old Ben Mind Tricks off early. You guys see that right there?
Guys, I'm gonna slow this down. You guys see anything out of the ordinary here? Do you guys see anything out of the ordinary from this old Ben mind tricks? Huh. 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 Interesting. All right, let's continue. He resisted. That is correct, Clash. He resisted. Padellos, tell me, what did you pay CG to... Give your echo such high tenacity. Please tell me. Please tell me. His potency is around 80 to 90 percent. Please tell me. And his tenacity on echo is like 40 percent. Please tell me. You're talking about no TMR. You're talking about no ability block. Two things. The ability block is almost guaranteed only if he has higher tenacity and it resists. The TMR is a percent chance to land, so I understand that that wouldn't land. But you're talking about those two things. Those two things. You couldn't at least get ability block to land here. Okay. What happens after? I do everything typical. I want to save that or the three PO thing. Didn't even notice like he still has high t or high turn meter on the echo. So like, what I should have done here, I was playing it kind of stupid. I should have seen that. I should have realized that, and I should have done this move onto fives, and then with this TMR echo. Because now the stun stops my mass assist from killing another person, like Ark. So, now we kill fives. This move would be targeted, or I guess you can just do an AoE here, that's fine too. That, that'll give you some more HP. And then that's where you're going to have 3PO's assist to kill somebody like Ark Trooper, so he can't dispel your old Ben Taunt. And then you taunt, and then he gets back up. In this part of the battle, two people should be dead. Fives and Ark. You, it's okay to have Rex alive only if he has ability block. If he, he, if he doesn't get ability blocked, then I will kill Fives, or I will kill Rex instead. So typically, you would want to kill Ark and Fives, and then he taunts like that so that all those hits go onto him. But since we got an AoE from Echo onto our 3PO, it made him low enough so that an AoE from Gas would kill our 3PO. So now we we don't get any more potent we don't get any more uh, exposes. And with all those buffs we've been getting over the last little bit, it's gonna boost up his offense. So now yeah, we can kill Rex. And Echo, but we can't kill Ark. See, like right there, if I didn't lose Han. Like, if he would have targeted one of the other guys, I probably would have had another RNG chance to not or to not lose that. But since he died, we lost. Another RNG chance here we could have had a 1 was if they, when he gets out of cover and he goes into advanced mode, is if he only hits CLS. But guess what? He didn't. He went for Chewy. So, if he would have hit CLS there, we would have gotten two counters. He would have been stunned. We keep on stunning him and stunning him. We win. So, guys... That is how the cookie crumbles. Let's just check out his tenacity. We'll check out my potency, his tenacity. So it did go up a little bit. It did go up a little bit. So I guess 50% 50, 50 ish. Because he, he was a relic for when we were fighting him in GAC. And I'm sure he, he swapped some mods around. Um, and then my old Ben. Stats, where is he? He's 
He's got 80%, guys. So... I don't know what else I could do there. I really don't. That, that was just the game telling me, you know what? You were that close to being the top. We're going to just screw you over right there. Say, see you later to your top ranks. Well, I got to just now come back. I was I was really wanting to shoot for a really high-end um, score. Uh, not score, I guess. I guess score. But uh, I want to go for a really high rank in GAC. Now I can't. But that brings me back down to the realization that GAC rewards still suck ass. So we're all good here, guys. We're all good here, boys. You, no, you guys don't... If there was any bad RNG that could have been the worst RNG possible, it was right there in that battle. It was right there, man. Okay, guys, throw me some questions. We're, we're done with GAC. Throw me some questions. Um, I'm going to, while we're, well, if you guys have any questions, I'm going to just show you what I'm going to do with my, my end game goal for GAC with my counters. Um, big shout out to Blade Baka for this because a lot of my stuff I would uh, do in GAC with my, my, my teams, it kind of, um, what's it called? I, I, I pull a lot from him. So, you guys have any questions? Um, BF2, yeah, I'm for sure going to play some BF2 today. That's why I stream earlier, so I can do some more. What went wrong? Um, I guess we can play it while I chat. We'll play it one more time for you, Dagger. Um, okay, so... Let's see. Um, you, do I feel okay? It's just a loss? I'm feeling... Guys, I'm feeling fine. The only reason I got so like right there, Dagger, um, Echo didn't get tena or he didn't get ability block. He didn't get TMR down. Ability block should almost always land, but he didn't land there. That's really really bad RNG. So now that I didn't I didn't notice that it didn't I didn't comprehend that he didn't get ability blocked because you can still win this if you don't get ability block. I didn't comprehend that. So later in the line, I was like just going through it typical. I was doing all my attacks here, right here. I should have understood that he was still. Not ability blocked. I should have TMR'd him now with CLS, but I didn't understand that. So the the RNG really screwed me up, and it kind of threw me all off. I didn't understand. So that's how it goes after that. Um, I feel fine though, man. Um, yeah, I, I feel fine, Boris. It was just a bad RNG day today. This happens to me uh, every so often. So might as well embrace the rage while you guys can. You don't get it every so often. It's typically Either I just squish somebody in GAC, I just steamroll them, or uh, something like this happens, you know, where I get bad RNG, so. Yeah, I mean, Dagger has a good point. Like, okay, sure, the uh, the, the ability block didn't land, but the, the, the fact that he landed a stun on my 3PO is, is really bad, so. This kind of makes me want to... Um, Oh, wait. I should have swapped this over here. This kind of makes me want to put more potency on old Ben. And just kind of forget about... Forget about, um... HP sets. Um, I think I am. I think so. Me protection. Any protection? 
Malik, my man, you got it for me. Heck yeah. Okay, so we lose 10 speed, but now we get close to 100% potency. I don't know the math, but that feels like... Yeah, I mean, if you were to continue watching that, man, like... First and foremost, Team Art didn't land, Ability Block didn't land. Repo gets done. That's that's lucky, I would say, for an echo, because um, he didn't he didn't even have potency up from uh, Rex. And then after that, um, what happened after that? Um, oh, they targeted my Han all the time. Nobody nobody else got hit. And then when I, when I did lose my Han, it was just CLS and Chewy there. They targeted my Chewy instead of my CLS. If they targeted my CLS and I got two counters, I get two I get a, I get two defense downs, which really means a stun. And I could just kept on stunning and stunning and stunning him, you know? So. It, I don't know the exact percent, but it should be just, like, based off of his potency and then to my 3PO's tenacity. So, I mean, if there's really... The, the, the RNG I can kind of understand is, okay, yeah, he's going to probably stun my 3PO if that happens. But what I don't get is how I didn't land a Billy Block there. So, you know what we're going to do here, boys? Is just give him more potency with an entire potency set on everything. Is there any potency we'd need? So, we got potency there. We probably should get some potency here, honestly. Yeah, we're going to use that mod. More potency, baby. Okay, now he's at 100%. I'm okay with that speed. You don't need him to be that fast for this 3PL counter. You'll be just fine. I don't have any potency here, though. That's one thing I could probably look into. There you go. Maybe I use this one. Okay, I'm going to keep this. Potency cross? Uh, I would only go for potency cross if he was a higher relic, because I still want him to be somewhat tanky, you know? You know, Dagger, I think it's honestly that, man. I think it's just straight up, you know what, Ian? Not today, man. Because, you know, you guys... Last last check of the GAC before I go, uh, I, I I hop off, I hop off. So if because I use my Gas versus Darth Rev and I use my JK versus the Grievous, and then I come back in the back wall, I see that if I beat that first tr first try, that still saves my crew team. If I save my crew team, I still have crew to use versus one of these teams. You know? Maybe I really should have saved Bastila and try to beat another, another one of these teams without... Wow. My voice is cracking. Without Bastila. And see how that would have worked. Because I'm pretty sure I could have used EP without BSF here. But we used Treya. We used EP there. And then we used um, Padme. See, I, I think I used... If I would have had used a uh, First Order versus that... And then I use Padme versus this team here. Or maybe I should have just not even used Padme there and you use Padme versus this team here. I still would have had another team left to use. I still would have had... I still would have had... Um, like, honestly, guys, if I were to split up my Padme, I wouldn't... Versus this team, I would, I would have just used a, a 3v5. Used... Um, What's his name? Uh, Anakin, Padme, and Ahsoka. Just call it good there because my Anakin will get a bonus turn sometime. He instantly kills everybody there, you know? And then I could have saved GK versus this other team, and we would instantly win. It would be so easy. It would be so easy. So there's still ways to go about that win, even after I still clean that up. Or, I mean, even if I do one-shot that team, like, I still win. So that's the thing here, guys. I don't think about that, Hoss Snakes, because honestly, GAC, that's probably the best counter to gas because you're not using your own gas you're not using a padme you can save padme for a different team so show us my defenses you'll probably see him soon enough if he if he hits me up but no i don't want to share him right now but here's the here's the thing i'm trying to shoot for guys if i can put my padme on defense that's a huge win that's a huge win so what I'm trying to shoot for after I get these Galactic Legends is to use um, my Nest versus a possible um, Padme teams. I could have even, I could have, if I had a Relic 7 Nest there, I could have easily beaten that, um, that Shock T team, easily. 
So, yeah, I think I'm probably done after this GAC with using Nest on defense. Actually, I don't know. Because she's not Relic 7 yet. I still want to usually I still want to use her in offense once she is Relic 7. So. Yeah, I could use Watt Tambor with CLS. Um, that's a possibility, but uh, I don't know about that. Because 3PO doesn't need to be with Padme. He doesn't. Yeah, you can, or not one of you, not, uh, let, me, let me clarify. You can use uh, Kira, Nest, and Hoda versus Padme. As long as the Anakin's uh, potency isn't crazy. Um, And then coming back, if I do see, like, I haven't seen a really good Night Sister team in forever. Um, um I, I want to build up my Bounty Hunters with, with, uh, with Watt and use that versus really good, um... Really, really good uh, Night Sisters. Because with Watt in there and the, and the tank tech on Bosk, yeah, you're going to just blast that away. And then once I do get that, I can build up my Hux and my first order on defense once I fix that bug with Hux. And then I have another, a solid, another really solid um, team. Honestly, I think what I should have done here is not even worry about my Grievous and BB-8 team. And just save the JTR, you know? I saved JZR there, guys, and I opened up another easy team to counter that, like, Kira team, so. Hux bug. So, the bug here is on his Zeta. There's an order of operations on the Zeta, so. This Zeta does not work on defense. I'll leave you, uh, I'll leave you, because this is pretty important. I'll leave, uh, I'll find the post. Reddit post from Baca, from Blade Baca. Let me find it. Here we go. Ah, dude, that sucks. Oh, let me paste that. There we go. So there is a link. There's an order. There's an order of operations. So it goes as unique. I mean, it's not really too... It's pretty much just like a... It's going to be a really quick fix bug. So, it's not worth going too much into. But if you pretty much, if you have Hux Zeta and you have been placing him on defense and you're like, why the heck is he getting one-shotted? I would not place him on defense for a little bit until they fix this. So, like, the Zald leadership, it didn't make them get TM. So, Hux Zeta is working as intended, but it just messed up the order of operations, pretty much. So, it stops... It, the Zeta works and it doesn't work. So it stops the leadership turn meter gain, but it does not stop the unique turn meter gain. So like BB-8's gain, that still works. Um, but like anything with turn meter, it stops that in the leadership. So. But yeah, I have some ideas I want to do. I want to I want to build up those guys. Um, oh, by the way, um, with with me getting the new ray, because I'm going to get it no matter what. Um, I'm trying to do my best to hoard as much as possible, and then if I need to, I'll buy it the rest. But I will probably be doing some pack openings to get probably Finn and Poe. I'll probably I'll probably be buying some of the crystals. Or sh the shards with my crystals to get Poe, and I'll probably have to just spend some money to get Finn up this relics or not relic seven, but to seven star. Because I, I am going to get Ray no matter what. That's just a, that's just a must for me. But yeah, I mean, I I think I saved a lot for offense. Like my defense, I have like five solid teams for defense, man. And then after that, it's just like boom, boom, boom. You're done. It's super, super easy. I think, though, if I, like, this is another thing, though, I, I always wish I had, I, I really wish I had a good trooper team, so that for that example of me needing to beat that Kira team, boom, it's done. Like, super, super easy, guys. If I was able to do that and, and not have to use something weird, and then I could have saved Watt for that Shock T team, 
easy wins, man. There's just so much stuff that I still have yet to work on that I have been putting on the back burner for so long. So, yeah, I think the my strategy with, with Nest and using her in GAC is use her on defense until she's high relic and then use her for offense. So... Okay, I want to just see what this now looks like now that I swap some mods around. Okay, I'm going to just hop off after this. I got to really hop off and get some stuff going. It was, I mean, you think about the stream, this just goes to show you about what's, what can happen. So like right there, that's what you want to see. That's beautiful. That's a, that's a beauty screenshot. You love seeing that. But instead of me doing a basic, I got to do an AoE so that I get more HP and protection on my, on my Chewy. There we go. Now we just go all out onto the fives. Okay, and then you want to kill Ark because he can dispel your uh, old Ben taunt. So now we're going to get a taunt up. This is what you want to see. This is like great RNG. Not really good. This is really good RNG. This is just like what should happen every single time. This is what, what happens when everything does go the way it should go. Okay, so I'm going to do one of those. Because Old Ben's going to die no matter what this next hit. Like, right there, he's dead. So, now I'm going to try to... Okay, we tanked that. That's really good. So, if we lose this from, from here on out, he's going to target Chewy, but he didn't. So, like, right there, I could probably still lose that if he hits my Chewy. But, I don't think it's that huge of an issue. I really don't. Should I Relic 7 Nest right now? I have everything ready to Relic 7 somebody up right now. Maybe this is a different modded team. I don't think so. It was Seb G, I think, right? So similar. But easier because of his GS is how he's modded. I don't... I don't like, though... The... Like, just in general, I think the Watt counter is way better. Way better than 3PO in there. Because you have um, you have weapon tech, and you have that tank tech on, on Old Ben. I don't like... I really don't like the 3PO. But when it comes to JC, it's really the better way to go about it. Just so you can save Watt for a, a different team. So... Now, I think I'm going to probably stop using JCR on defense now. Because without BB-8 in there, it's pretty useless. So... All right, so yeah, we lost this round, boys. I just saw what he messaged me. He has a lot of other teams left, so it's a GG. Gonna try to still try to get Kyber. I think we'll be fine to get Kyber though. Um, I really just want to. I really just want to rage, rage gear my nest up to Relic Seven because I can do it right now. But if I know if I do that, I'm probably not gonna be able to have enough signal data to get somebody else up. So. You can buy some of this now, though. Okay. We'll just do all of them right here. Unlucky, man. So unlucky. Alright, guys. I'm going to head off. GG's. We got screwed over. Um, what else can you do? You can't do anything about it. You can't do anything about it. You just... you just. When something like that happens and how bad of RNG that is, you just take it like a man. You just say, okay. I'll take that L. Move along. So, that is what we're doing, guys. I'm going to go probably stream some Battlefront 2 later. Can't believe that some people got triggered in this stream today. If you guys really have an issue there, please let me know. So, yeah. Peace out, guys. I'll see you guys next week in GAC. Hopefully, I don't suck ass. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys then. Peace out.